trouble and it hasn't stopped and nor is it stopping they're trying to replace the board of directors with the stanley brothers they haven't been able to do that there weren't enough votes instead they pulled the president of reynolds santa fe that's a tobacco company the problem is now for the stanley brothers is that they don't own their company and that it's being run into the ground and now it's being taken internationally which pretty much means they should probably start growing new weed also news, New Jersey regulators propose allowing cannabis to be studied by local universities, pairing up legal dispensaries with these people who could study the cannabis. The idea is they want to know what people are actually smoking and what's available to the public in New Jersey. And the universities are interested in actually looking at the exact strains of cannabis and the medicinal properties of the cannabis people have access to both in recreational and medical facilities. It's been a long time that people have been pretending that the cannabis isn't a medical miracle, but now the cat's out of the bag and no one can shut up about it because the fact of the matter is cannabis is first food and then medicine. Also in news, a group called CANRA, they're a multi-state group of regulators, they want to make sure the 2023 hemp bill doesn't include any cannabis is not being used for fiber or food or building materials. What they're saying is they want any product that has a medicinal use to be controlled by the FDA. They don't want folks who are involved in cannabis to be making gummies and Delta 8. They want them to be making flags, chairs, and backpacks. What they're saying is that the 2018 hemp bill allowed for hemp products, but people are taking advantage and they're working outside of the scope of what was intended for that legislation. Thanks for watching the watch! Damn!